Hello viewers, welcome back. So this is the sixth video as part of our series of video on Tally's latest release, 5.0. This is going to be the part two of our session connected with the session that I had covered regarding the creation of party ledger master from the GST information. So in the part one, we saw how you can specify the GSTIN of a party master and fetch the complete registration detail of the party from the GST portal and save that as your ledger without typing any information related to the party. So I had mentioned that Tally also provides you facility for bulk creation of party ledger using the GSTIN of each of the party. So there are two ways of creating bulk party master in Tally 5.0. Let us go to Tally and explore the two different ways how you can create multiple ledger master at the go in Tally without you manually creating individually each party along with all the details related to the party master. Under part one of our video, under the title, Create and Check Party Ledger GST Filing History from Within Tally Prime. So we saw how you can use the GSTIN to verify the registration detail of the party and create the ledger in Tally. So let me quickly show you if you want to create a ledger master of a party. So we go to create, select ledger and here instead of typing the name, all you have to do is just click here, fetch details using GST. When you click here, you have to just enter the GST of the party that you want to create. So I'm going to select a particular GST, enter. And now it has gone to the GST portal and it has picked up the information of this particular party master as reflecting in the GST portal. And this is going to be as per book. If you want, we can create. We also saw that how you can see their last six months filing history when you click on filing history we are able to see their filing history for the last six months and also their registration date and the principal place of business the nature of business and the additional place of business every information we are going to get from the portal now let us say you want to create multiple party master instead of going and creating individual party ledger master tally has a facility where you can enter the GSTINs of all your party master in bulk and get the information of all the party masters at one go and save them as your party master ledger in Tally. So how do we do that? From the gateway of Tally, when you click on display more report, so you have this statutory report, click on statutory report. We have GST report, click on GST report. Under GST report, we have GST utilities, click on utilities and then we have this option called create party using GSTIN. So click here and Tally is now asking you to specify the GST number of the parties that you want to create. Any number of parties GST you can enter here. For example, so this is one party's GST, enter. You can select the second party's GST, enter the second party's GST, third party GST. So this way you can keep entering the GST of the parties that you want to create. Under the fourth serial number, just press enter in the blank and accept. Tally is again gone and it has picked up the information from the portal for each of the parties. So you will see here these are three different parties. Only thing you have to make sure that the group here, if you are creating all your suppliers, then you can come here and then select sundry creditors and it will automatically change to sundry creditors for all the party masters. In case the party masters that you are creating is falling under the group of sundry debtors and sundry creditors, then you can select all items, enter and here when you now press enter, it will tally will take you to the group where you can select the group of the respective parties. Now just by pressing control A or accepting, these three party masters will get created automatically with all the information that is the address of the party state okay and we also know the GSTN status of the party registration type plus you also have additional information GSTN of the party pan of the party and in case if you want to see their filing history all you have to do is just press Y 
and when you press enter it will take you to that particular party master detail click on filing history you will get the filing history of this particular party so i'm not going to save here i'll show you the other way where you can capture the gstn of all the parties in the excel sheet if you have already captured them then you don't have to manually enter the gstn of the party you can actually import the gstns that you have created of your party masters in excel and tally will automatically capture all those gstns here and we saw once you accept it it is going to fetch the detail of all the parties so how do we now import the gstns that you have captured in excel very simple if you notice here instead of typing this manually just see on the right hand side button bar we have this button called import gstn from excel so click on excel there is no format nothing all you have to do is just capture in any one column like in column a or column b just start capturing the gstns and you have to now select the folder and the file name which has your gstns so i have created a folder called gstn and the file is there so i'm going to say select from drive d drive then i'm going to say gstn enter now this is the excel file that i have gstn xls file enter the worksheet name i had given the worksheet name as gstn enter and import data from which column if the gstn that you have captured is in column a tally will automatically show you the list just press enter and accept now if you see all the seven gstns have automatically populated here all you have to do is just press control a and these party details have come very simple all you have to do is just press control a and the party masters of seven parties have been created just make sure that the grouping is proper let us go to chart of account and see whether these ledger masters have been created click on go to and just type chart of accounts select ledger and if you see here all these seven ledger masters have been created under my group of sundry debtors since these are my customers so again as i mentioned earlier if you change the grouping then automatically they will be grouped under the respective group of sundry debtors or sundry creditors now let us see whether it is captured all the detail go to first party master which is click tell retail private limited just click here and you will notice that the address state pin code pan registration type the gstn every information is captured I hope this video would immensely help you in quickly creating multiple masters using the GST's connected feature. And we saw that especially with the help of Excel, you can capture all the GST in Excel, import them. And we also witnessed that how easy it is to create multiple ledger master by one click of a button. So in the upcoming session, we will see more connected GST features that is provided in Release 5.0. Thank you all once again for staying till the end. See you all in the next session. Thank you very much.